Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Hope everybody's keeping well. Well, I'm, I'm down the beach. I'm going to meet up with a couple of the guys and hopefully I'm going to get a session on the water and the foil. I've got my new uh, mast with me today and that's the uh, Gong High Modular Mast. Um, now, have I been sold a GoPro 13? Have I been sold as the latest gimmick or is it worth somebody like myself who's just an average Joe wing foiler will it make a difference to my everyday riding i'm just kind of catching a few waves doing some tacks and some jabs and just enjoying being on the water and being a part of the wing foiling community in the northeast so will this benefit me um i do want to use bigger front wings so that's kind of pushed the bullet for me and made me buy it because i wanted to use bigger front wings so i needed a titanium fuse large and also it's advised to use a high modular mast as well just to make everything a little bit stiffer with those wings that are a little bit more than a hundred centimeter wide so when you're getting into the 120s and 130 centimeter wide wings so i'm going to try that see how i get on with that today see if it was worth a purchase see if it's faster and then i'll get back to you guys and tell you what i think i am kind of hoping there is some benefits but i'm not going to hold my breath so anyway guys i hope you enjoy this one so i'm going to get on the water get set up i'll take a few pictures of the uh, new kit and then i'll see you at the end and uh, i'll give you my final thoughts so take care and i'll see you out there
Hi there, yeah, just back from the beach. Fantastic day. It was an onshore breeze, so it was a little bit tricky to get out at first, but it was great to be out there when we did get out the back. It was about two, three foot swell, 30 mile an hour winds onshore. So yeah, the mass was fantastic. Um, it was one of those things where it's a subtle change. It is a little bit different to um, my normal mass. My normal mass, I would say, is probably a little bit forgiving. You don't have to be as precise, whereas because every single movement you make is transferred to your foil from your mast you have to be a little bit more precise you have to be a bit more careful about where you put your feet on your foot swaps and also when you're uh, going down a wave etc you've got to be a little bit more precise it was probably a little bit faster through the water as well and overall it just made the whole thing just feel a little bit cleaner it made your foil feel like it wasn't getting hit by as much turbulence from the waves etc um, and it just felt really really nice so is it a luxury yeah it's probably a massive luxury and you probably don't need it um, it's probably one of those things that as you get more advanced it's nice to have but not essential um, I'm gonna try it a little bit more obviously this is just my first initial impressions of it I'm gonna try it a little bit more on some flat water and try it in some different conditions and come back to you I want to see if it's a little bit faster I'm gonna do a speed test on it at some point so that'd be interesting um, against my old mast as well which I've still got so I'm gonna play around with that and you'll see that in a later video so thanks for watching hope you've had a nice time watching this and I'll catch you all later so good wins take care